I do it when I walk down the street because there are so many homeless people littered all over the place that if I stopped and acknowledged each and every one of them, my heart would break and I'd never recover. Sometimes you become invisible, or you feel invisible. Being invisible, feeling useless, obsolete, is the worst thing. My name is Cynthia English and I'm currently 56 years old. I was born in Brooklyn, New York in 1963 and um, I got married when I was 19, had my first child when I was um, 21, then my second child when I was 28. And by the time I was about 32 or 33, I knew the marriage was over. I ended up having to have him removed from the home by the police. Then when I removed him from the home, I fell apart. All the years of abuse just caused me to implode. everything. I ended up living in the street, living in the street. And I lived this way for six years. I had been on and off psychiatric medication for the entire six years. Was 
so precarious that I couldn't figure out how to save myself. who are long-term homeless, even if we have families and childhood friends and normal support systems, once you become homeless, there's a stigma attached. And while you're going through the course of homelessness and navigating all of the difficult things you have to navigate, many of us lose touch with those family members and friends because we're ashamed. could adopt one person to be friends with, to give them that encouragement, to give them back some of their humanity, and help them feel like they can move forward, that would do a lot for a lot of people, being looked in the eye and treated like a human being, treated with respect, like a human being, like a human being. Bye. 
of us adopt one person. Each of us adopt one person. Us one person. Us one person. One person. One person.